Oh my God, Jesus, your love is too much. Oh. Too much. Your love makes God. Your love is patient. You feel my heart with so much peace and joy. Yeah, you're amazing.
Get a more set that 
Hallelujah. Jehovah, Meli wo, wo Meli wo. Imo si pini ni gwe, anasi Hallelujah, anagu Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You have won the victory. I'm 
Jesus. Yes. You are Can we lift our hands in worship and sing to him this morning that you are I am. Please lift your hands. You are not under punishment. It's a sign of surrender to Jesus. Help me know. You want to sing it out of your heart one more time? Oh, 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 you are, I want. If you want him, if you need him, lift your voice and sing to him. You are, I ever Oh, 
yes, he is about all the roads, about all wonder the word of seven no ah, about all wealth rose up and treasures on the earth. There's no way to measure what you worth, what you worth, yeah. Crucified, lay beyond the storm. He leaves to die, rejected.
Jesus to the highest mountain and its floor to the Lord.
have come before my Lord and King the one who gave his life for I'll raise the man now all his name unto the nations on him. The champion was Abba and captain of my destiny. In you, the Lord, I may
30 seconds, I want you to glorify him one more time in this place. Come on, lift your voice and give him praise and glorify him. He's deserving of our praise, he's deserving of our worship. Yeah, 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 yeah. thought that you came to experience God. I thought that you came to meet God. And for those who would meet God and experience God, they need a certain attitude. And right now, I can't see that attitude. As you are shouting and you are clapping, the Lord is depositing your miracle. The louder your clap, the better your attitude, the louder and the glamorous your miracle. I thought somebody would show Jesus how great they are for him. I thought somebody would show Jesus how gaga they are for the Lord. Give Jesus a mighty shout offering. If you are excited, if you feel blessed to be alive this morning, Give Jesus some praise. Give Jesus some praise. If you are certain, you are certain on your miracle. Those who are certain, you are certain on your breakthrough. I thought the last person will stand on their feet and give Jesus a mighty shout of friend. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. If you are not sick, even if you are not feeling well, I want you to be on your feet. Hallelujah. As the worship was going on, I was watching some demeanors and things, and I'm like, this is prayer palace. And the last time I checked, you are in the prophetic arena. 
And in the prophetic arena, everything that happens here is what prophetic. Are we communicating here? And so if I were you, I will get myself involved. Listen, my brother, my sister, whatever problems that you came with, please check them at the gates. Open up yourself and get ready for what the Lord has for you. I pray for somebody, any form of entanglement, be free from it. Hallelujah. Say, Lord Jesus, I am free. I am ready for what you have for me. This morning, as we encounter you in this double perfume service, I am living here with an aroma that attracts the goodness and the mercies of the Lord. I declare, after today, I shall attract money, connections, favor, good connections, favor. After today, I decree and I declare, my life will never be the same. In the name of Jesus, if you believe it, shout and clap unto Jesus. Now look to your neighbor and say, neighbor, I don't know about you, but I can promise you, this will be my best service yet in 2024. Say, neighbor, look at me very well. If you are not careful, the next time we meet here, you will beg to sit next to me. Say, neighbor, look at me very well. If you are not careful, the next time you see me, you will be going through protocol to have an appointment with me. Say, neighbor, say, neighbor, look at me again. If your neighbor is not looking at you, hold the neighbor and hold the head and say, shabani, shabani, look at me. Say, neighbor, look at me. If it is your wife, my brother, go easy. Say, neighbor, look at me. If care is not taken, after this morning service, I shall be your boss. What is the neighbor saying? <laughs> Clap your hands for Jesus. Hallelujah. Now we are getting there. Say, neighbor, I am ready. I am supercharged. The altar is calling me. The altar is speaking for me. I don't know about you, but I can promise you, I am not living here the same way I came in. I pray for you, but as I live with my miracle, you also live with your testimony. One thing I will ask of you, don't disturb me. Turn that China phone off. Turn that China phone off. I will not be disturbed. I will not be disturbed. I refuse to be disturbed. Now say, neighbor, congratulations. You are blessed. Like I am blessed this morning. In Jesus' mighty name. Clap your hands. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Please sit on the eyes of your enemies. The way you are massaging your enemies' eyes, be on your feet again. See, the Bible is not just a book. You understand what I'm saying? The Bible said that the, 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 the people of the world, they are wiser than we who are of the kingdom. That's why when they caught something, they took out his eyes. So the first course of action when you catch your enemy, take off their eyes. And as you sit on the eyes of your enemies, what are you doing? You are rendering them, you are rendering them impotent and powerless. If they can't see you, how can they touch you? The spirit that is monitoring you, as you say, can say, do channel phone, who's channel phone? Who's going to do channel phone? It's my phone. So it's my phone. Turn it off for me. Hallelujah. Clap for Jesus. <laughs> turn it off for me. I can't turn it off what's up here. Amen. <laughs> Clap for Jesus. Amen. 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 So as you sit on the eyes of your enemies, you, they can't monitor you again. That monitoring spirits. Hey. 
That monetary spirit, they can monitor you again. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. So please sit on the eyes of your enemies for me. Aha, uh -huh. clap for yourselves now. <laughs> hallelujah. On behalf of our father, the prophet, prophet Manole G, and our mother, Mami Anike G, I welcome all of us to this morning's turning point service. I can promise you that by the time you leave here, you would, be ex you would have experienced a certain turnaround in every, in, the, in every aspect of your life. Those watching us online, thank you so much for deciding to serve onto our page and to stay here with us. Listen, you could have been anywhere else, but you chose to be with us. And for that, I say God richly bless you. One thing I would ask of you, like my father would always say, just make sure that even as you watch us, that you share us for others to also benefit from what Jesus is about to do this morning. In-house, please help me celebrate our virtual members. Clap your hands with me if you could. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Offering time. Offering time. Second Corinthians chapter 9, 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 7. And I read, every man according, every man according as he purposed in his heart, so let him give, not gradually, or of necessity, for God loves a cheerful giver. So this morning, give cheerfully, not gradually, but give cheerfully. With this said, declare a word over your offerings. In this house, we have been taught by our Father to name our seed, to name our offerings. So give your offering an, an, a name. You could say that this is my love offering. Just because I love Jesus, I am giving this offering to him. Or this could be the offering that breaks through for your um, American visa or your Canadian visa or for your Togo visa, whatever visa you're looking for. But this could be the door, the, the, the offering that opens that door for you. This could be the, the offering that give, brings your marriage. Whatever it is. Speak a word on the offering. If you are watching us online, within my sight and my sound, gracefully, it is church without walls, and we encourage you to give. The Bible um, says in Deuteronomy chapter 16, that God said to Moses, tell them, as often as they come into my presence, never to come empty-handed. So it is only expedient that you give. Let us continue to speak a word over our offerings, even as we prepare to give it unto Jesus. Let us speak a word over our offerings. Speak a word over it. Declare a word over the offering. Make sure that you give. As you do so, kindly be on your feet as we do this corporately after you have declared your individual word over the offerings. We would Hold the offerings up and pray corporately and believe God that our prayers be answered. Lift, be on your feet if you could, gracefully. Speak your word over the offerings. Those online, we encourage you to give through any of the platforms on the screen, but make sure that you give. If you're in-house and you're looking to give through any of the digital platforms, the numbers are on the screen if you need help. With any of the numbers, if you are new here, please see any of the ushers and they can help you with the mobile money accounts, even as we have them. Lift them up. If your offerings are ready, lift them up. Lift them up. Just lift them up. Just lift them up. Lift the offerings up. As though you are presenting unto God a sacrifice. Just lift it up. Some are still praying, I can see. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Let's pray. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you for first giving us what we have and making it possible for us to give back to you. It is a privilege we don't take for granted. We say thank you, Abba Father. We ask that every prayer whispered on these offerings will come to pass because you said that when we call upon you, you, you said that we should call upon you and you will answer us. Father, let it come to pass. One thing we would ask of you is that in the end, when the testimonies has come, that all the glory will be given unto you. And these same testimonies will gather other men into heaven. 
even to your glory. We thank you for answered prayer. In Jesus' name, amen. Please, the ushers will direct you from the back as you bring them in. God richly bless you. Hallelujah. Clap your hands, clap your hands, bow 
Bible says that clap your hands, all you people, and give God a shout of praise. If you are excited to be here, come on, clap your hands and give God a shout.
Come on, slap your hands together for Jesus. Come on, come on, come on, come on. If you can do better unto Jesus. I said you can do better unto Jesus. The one that shouts, claps, jumps, receives the biggest breakthrough ever. Come on, celebrate the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. The Rose of Sharon, the Lily of the Valley, the one that starts and no one completes. The one that opens a door and no man has the ability to shut. When he shuts a door, no man can open. The one that measures the cloud with his finger. Now do it better. And let him know that you appreciate what he's been doing for you and for your family. Come on. Hallelujah. Shoot your right hands above your head. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. This morning, this morning, I have come once again. I have come once again. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Do what no man can do. Do what no man can do. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I shall lift up my voice in prayer. As I shall lift up my voice in prayer. I position myself to receive. I position myself to Say, receive. Say, oh Lord. Oh Lord. Do what no man can do. Do what no man can do. Open my file. Open my file. Address my case. Address my case. Give me an experience. Give me an experience. Wow. Yes. Now, do you know why I said wow? Because I heard God say it is granted. Amen. Now, yes. now, it's very difficult to work with a prophet. Yes. I was doing my declaration. God says, stop it. All what you have said has been granted. Amen. Amen. Now I, I feel like I feel like prophesying to somebody since prophesy. it has been granted. Since it has been granted, can I prophesy to somebody? Prophesy. Tomorrow about this time. Yes. You are coming here with a testimony. Amen. I said tomorrow about this time. Yes. You are coming here with a testimony. Amen. Where you used to be was the last time you went there. Yes. A new season and a new level has happened to you. Amen. Only seven people shouted an amen. amen. Yeah. amen. Now, I, I promise you this. Yes. I might not mention your name or your phone number uh. or describe your village. But trust me. By the time you exit this auditorium. Yes. yes. <laughs> uh. By the time you exit this auditorium, yes, Lord. you look back to yourself and say, ah, where did I go? Hey. Oh, that you know the potency and the ability of God's yes. power yes. in this house. Amen. Touch your neighbor and say, neighbor. neighbor. Are you ready to stand in the gap? Are you ready to stand in the gap? Attention to the next person. Neighbor, are you ready to pray? Neighbor, are you ready to pray? Now move to three people and tell that three people that don't distract me today because I am ready to receive. Three people. Come on, let's do that. You don't have to worry. Uh, don't you be. Have you done three already? Then do 12. Ah, three there, there, there. Now, one, two, 12. If you, if you do less than 12, you've missed 29 miracles. So count. Now, it's scripture. The Bible says when a man tells you to go one mile, go seven miles. So whatever I say, double it and triple it. Let's go. Oh. You don't have to worry. And don't you be.
sing it. I know that I can stand no matter, no matter what. My heart says, hey, with Jesus I can, with Jesus I can make it. With Him I know, with Him I know. No matter what go on, may come away. My love is in your head. church right but when you see a car passing they're not afraid of cars pee 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 they will not mind you let it drizzle you see hell is scattering amen but we thank God that you were able to be here and I believe that God is up to something unique and extraordinary in the next few minutes we'll get into some serious prayer points and directions right so get yourself ready, prepare for what God will do. But we have a great man of God in the house I want to introduce, and then I move straight into the word of God. I have known him for years. Yes, these are the pioneers of E Outreach Ministry Dallas. I remember when God asked me to start a ministry in Dallas. Himself, the wife, held me down. And it was a beautiful time in Dallas. Till today, I'm not sure that anybody had ever gone there to do the kind of meeting we did. Never. It has never happened. That is 2012, 2013, 2014. I think the last one was 2015, right? 2015. That's when I did my last conference in Dallas. It was something else. And it was, it was a revival. Let me say a revival. It was something. You, you, you come early... You find a good place, you come late, you don't have a place to sit. And over the years, we've been connecting. And today, he's here with us. He's also one of the ammo bearers of the assistants of Bishop T. Jakes. Shall we appreciate <laughs> Pastor Jonathan Darko? Amen. God bless you, man of God, for coming. Amen. God bless you. And I'm also here. Amen. I'm here. They are coming from Dallas, me to Adi, Adi, Adi Spinter's Road. Amen. And then we have our own resident pastor here. <laughs> he doesn't like it, but hey. He's a good man. Very, very good man. Amen. Good man. Good man. Good man. This guy can kill for me. He's a good man. Amen. He's a very good man. Very good man. I wish there's another word to describe goodness. I would have given it to him. He's a good man. Yeah. I'll, be, I'll be very shocked if I hear that he has said something bad about me. It would be strange to me because I don't think so. I don't think so. You know me, I'm a mafia. I've tried him a lot of times. 
And all the times, he was clean. All the times. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. One time, I was driving home. And God revealed to me about his conversation. He was on the phone with somebody. And I saw it. So I, after I picked the phone and I called him. He doesn't know. That, it was, that call was a setup call. I called him and I said, I've been calling you. You're not picking. He said, I was with, online with X, Y, Z person. And I asked, how many minutes have you been on the phone? He gave me the exact time. And I, 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 it was on my phone. I was checking. And he's a good man. Amen. There are few assistants like him. Few. 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 Few assistants like him. Few. And another time, I was aware, previewed this one. The person told me. I asked a question in my office. He gave the same answer. I didn't, I didn't tell him. I was just quiet. It's been like that back to back. One time, somebody made an error. You know, when you go to other ministries, you want to see the pastor, you want to tape. <laughs> if you try, you are doomed. We want to suffer in dignity. You can't bribe us. The person made a mistake to pull offering. <laughs> I said, the person doesn't know this man. That was the last time the person stepped in my office. If you try, you are, you are blacklisted for life. Are you understanding me? You can't bribe him. So when you see that he has brought somebody to my office, it's not because the person has given you anything. You can't. Every seed you give him, he asked me permission to take before he would take. That's the kind of assistant I have. Are you understanding me? And go to other, I'm saying it in camera because that's the truth. I don't, I don't lie. That's the truth. If you go to other places before you see the man of God, you pay solely. You see this man, see that man, see that man before you see the main man. By the time you meet the main man, you're tired. It doesn't happen here. It doesn't happen here. In the same way, when he tells you that do this, he has my backing. He has my backing. He has it 100%. Now, listen, I, listen, can I help you? I can't support you against him. It's not, it will not happen. I can't support you against him. So if you have an issue with him, already you are condemned. No, that's the truth. I'm telling you the truth. I'm not lying. If I have an issue with him, whether you are right or you are not right, you are condemned in my presence. You can't explain yourself to me. You can't. From the junior pastors down to the church is the truth. Because hear me carefully. The kind of work he does for me, you cannot do it for me. You can't. Even if you have the opportunity, you cannot do it for me. Are you understanding me? He's not on salary. And he's always with me. So how does he feed? How does he feed his family? He, not that we can't pay him. By the grace of God, we can. He rejected it. He said, no. I can't take salary in this ministry. When my father does not take salary. <laughs> yeah. So if I tell you that I love him. It's not to make him look good, but that's the truth. That's the truth. That's the truth. So we appreciate him. Come on. Amen. Now, something strange happened. Let me say, I've not said it yet. You remember on his 10th anniversary, I decided to get him a car. And so I gave him my own car, one of the the cars I cherished, in fact. I wouldn't have given that car to anybody. But that car, me, I love. So I gave it to him. Do you know, for so many weeks, he was not driving the car because of the honor he has for me. He can't, he can't see himself drive his father's car. So I have to force him 
to even drive. Later, he gave it to the wife to drive. That's the man I'm, that's the man I'm talking about. So I said to him, I said to him, there are some security details. All my cars are security, and this one I can't tell you. So I had to remove all those things in the car. He said, no, 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 no. It must be like that. I don't want to touch anything in the car. That is mobile order. Say, what? Get him out of seven. <laughs> so, you see, people like him, I can preach him the whole day and still have more to say about him. I love him. That's it. First Samuel chapter, 2 Samuel chapter 9, verses 1 to 12. 2 Samuel chapter 9, verses 1 to 12. It's going to be a very short sermon, all right? And then quickly we will enter into some prayers. And when God gives us a word, we will, we will release. And I have a lot of men of God in the house. God bless everybody for coming. Amen. Second Samuel chapter 9, verse 1 to 12. All right. And David said, And David said, Is there yet any that is left uh -huh. of the house of Saul? Uh -huh. But I may show him kindness yeah. for Jonathan's sake. Okay. Verse 2. And there was of the house of Saul a servant whose name was Ziba. And when they had called him unto David, the king said unto him, At thou Ziba. At thou Ziba. Said, and he said, and he said, thy servant is thy servant has is done he. One. Uh -huh. Verse three. Mm -hmm. And the king said, is there not yet any of the house of Saul that I may show the kindness of God unto him? And Ziba said unto the king, Jonathan had yet a son which is lame on his feet. Mm -hmm. Verse four. And the king said unto him, where is he? And Ziba said. Unto the king, behold, he is in the house of Machir, okay. the son of Amiel mm. in Lodiba. Mm. Verse 5. Then King David sent and fetched him out of the house of Machir, the son of Amiel from Lodiba. Verse 6. And now, when Mephibosheth, the son of Jonathan, the son of Saul, was come unto David, he fell on his face and did reverence. And David said, Mephibosheth. And he answered, Behold, thy servant. Verse 7. And David said unto him, Fear not, for I will surely show thee kindness mm. for Jonathan, thy father's sake. I'll show you kindness for the sake of Jonathan. Say for the sake of Jonathan. For the sake of Jonathan. Say for the sake of Jonathan. For the sake of Jonathan. Now, can I help you? Let's, 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 let's digress a bit and we'll come back. Don't ever think you're a superstar. There are people who carry on common grace that if you connect with them, God will bless you. God says, I am not blessing you because you are handsome. I am not blessing you because you are beautiful. I'm blessing you because of association. So association is extremely important. Now, are we communicating here? There are people when you associate, you are blessed. There are people when you associate with them, you are cursed. Now, are we communicating here? Those who were in the camp of Korah and Abihu, because they were in the camp and God was angry with them, once the earth opened, they all got down into the earth association. And those who were with Jonathan, that's Mephibosheth, because of his association, the Bible says he was remembered. Hear me carefully. Who do you submit to? Who is your friend? Even those you marry, they are very important. Are we communicating here? Yes. They are people when you marry them, you are doomed. There are others when you marry, you go well. You do well in life. Association. Please, don't just enter any church. There are certain churches when you get there, you will not do well. Now, are we communicating here? Yes. I was in Canada. Canada, very far. Canada. And then somebody walks to me and said, please, please. Uh, can, you, can you say hi to uh, Percy for me? Percy. Say hi to Percy for me. Say hi to Percy. Who knows Percy? They know him because he stands in the same platform to minister with me. Finished. Association. 
association. Are we honest? Are we communicating here? Association. I was in the UK. A woman came for counseling. And then he gave me three envelopes. The woman did not give me an envelope. And the name they've written, the small prayer warrior. You're, Daniel, where is he? Did I bring you the envelope? Yeah. He said, when he's praying, the way the guy is praying, the energy. I love it. So the, the woman wrote, he doesn't even know his name. He just saw that the guy is praying whilst I'm preaching. So he gave the guy an envelope, wrote his name, the small prayer warrior. So I asked Pastor Zuempa, who is the small prayer warrior? He says, Daniel. I said, he has an envelope. And wrote another one and wrote Bright. Where's Bright? Did I bring you an envelope? Yeah, wrote Bright and wrote Pastor Usubempa. And I said, Mama, where's my own? He said, well, you don't need anything now. <laughs> <laughs> so, so they are in Ghana. Are you understanding me? And somebody in the UK, so association, association, association. Are we communicating? My cousin Saki sits here, and one, one day went to the bank. Now, when he went to the bank, I'm still preaching on. I ain't been met in team, my bread. <laughs> went to the bank. Now, he was in the queue when somebody told, one of the workers told Saki that the bank manager says, I should bring you to his office. So Saki said, ah, yeah. He said, come. So he came, sat off, they gave him tea to drink. He was enjoying biscuit he chewed. And they served him. So he asked the guy, hey, do you know me? He said, your spiritual father is my spiritual father. Yeah. He said, who? He said, prophet Emmanuel J. So because of me, he's chewing biscuit. <laughs> now, are we communicating here? So association. Say association. Association. Say association. Association. So I will bless you for Jonathan's sake. In life, be very strategic. Don't just associate. Don't. Be strategic. I tell people, even in business, be strategic. They are people you should consciously be friends to or friends with. Some. Do you know what you must do? Christmas, buy a card and go and give to them. You don't know. Every big man on this earth is alone or lonely. The top is lonely. And every big man thinks that people who come around them they are coming to take. So what you must do is that your boss, once in a while, buy him a card. Once in a while, buy him a gift. Once in a while, buy him lunch. How much is lunch? You'll be shocked the impression you are making on your boss. When there is time for promotion, he will recommend you. You are stingy. You are, you are so stingy to the point that... Now look at the things I am, I am telling him. Look at the things I'm telling him. Now when I want to give him a gift, I'm, 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 I'm shy. Because he has rejected salary. So now, if I travel and I get some pounds, I'll give him some. So now he has rejected CDs and he's chopping pounds. <laughs> you see what? Smartness? <laughs> so now, he has put too much burden on my heart that I'm thinking, how does he survive? How does he survive? How does he survive? But if he was on normal, okay, mature, kako, baby, do home. Association and smartness. I will bless you for Jonathan's sake. I will bless you for Jonathan's sake. Listen to me carefully. There are people when you meet them, don't let them go. There are people don't let them live your life. Even if you'll be a fool to keep that relationship, do it. Are we communicating here? Even if you'll be a fool to keep that relationship, do it. Because there are certain places Money cannot take you. What will take you is endorsement and association. And somebody must give you that endorsement. Somebody must give you that association. Can you give God some praise right here? I remember I was traveling to Cote d'Ivoire for a conference. And one of the protocol guys said, oh, let's go. So he sat in the plane. As soon as he sat in the plane, he started crying. All his life, he has not sat in the plane before. Now, that's not a story. We entered Cote d'Ivoire, and then they sent convoy from the presidency. P, the guy sat in with me. Who are you to enjoy this kind of privilege? But because he was holding my bag, sometimes it is better to hold a bag than to hold a microphone. That's right, that's right. <laughs> are you understanding me? The guy was not a resident pastor. 
He was not a resident pastor. Oh. We are the old site. He was not a resident pastor. The resident pastor was in Accra. Taking care of the post. Oh. And the protocol guy is sitting in presidential convoy. Where I slept, he slept there. What I ate, he ate some. Because when you are ordering the food, you don't order half plates. You order full plates. So he was eating the same food I was eating. He was sleeping on the same bed, similar bed I slept on. Short association. Association. So hear me carefully. Sometimes, 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 forgo money and keep relationship. Now, are you understanding me? Let me give you another example. Uh, Joseph, since he came here, he has never given me a problem before. Never. I said to his father, his father is a pastor. His father has a church. This is my keyboardist. His father has a church, but he's here. And I don't know who plays for his father. I don't know. And Bright too, same. Bright's father has a church. His father is a general overseer. His father is a general overseer. He's a pastor's boy from infancy. True of us. Yeah. But he's always here. Never once have I heard that it was just recently that they wanted to do some aluta and I, I put them to order sharp. And since that they have seen that they are, they are come. Now, I'm, listen, I'm preaching. It, you might think what I'm saying doesn't make sense, but please, it will help you. It will help you. I'm very honest. Me, I appreciate one year there, so I'm true with him. I'm very fair. So what happened is that by the grace of God, we're doing direction for visa. And all of a sudden he had his visa. Yeah. Now when he was going, do you know what I did? I gave him my credit card. And I gave him my password. I said, anything that you need, if you're in trouble, use it. Association. Free card expenses. Good. When he went to Canada, he was eating in my house. Eating my wife's food. <laughs> Me that I've gone to marry. He's enjoying my wife's food on my behalf. Association. Yeah. Are you understanding me? Say association. Say association. All these years when he was working there, he never thought that one day he would be with me in a foreign land. He never thought. So a lot of times when God gives you the opportunity to be with certain class of people, please fight your ego, fight your pride, and humble yourself because the future is always better than now. Nobody knows how the future will look like. If I knew that I would come to prayer palace and start a church here on the Sprinters Road, and 10 years ago, they gave me a land. You know where, what do you call it? More than 10 years, 20 years ago, they gave me a land where Christ Embassy is at Nungwa, uh, opposite aviation there. That land was given to me. I said, we, here, what am I doing? My man is in America. I went, uh, I am back here. What I'm trying to say is that there are certain opportunities that God gives you and you think, no, I don't need it now because I want my stomach to be filled. You'll be sure that day that you need the person. No, we do not need no one. Then you need that person. Now, are we communicating here? Say, I will, say, I will bless you will bless. for Jonathan's sake. I, I think, I think, I think, let me die. I'll preach my message next week. Let me f follow. Huh? Change your work. You want to change lights? Oh. Okay, change light, change light. Let's go. Quickly, turn off the stuff. Okay, we are moving to power.
in your success, the glory in your elevation, the glory when you are doing well. Wow. You remember, I think the seven days fasting and prayers, I sat here and all my pastors were preaching. After every program, what I do is that I sit them down and I begin to correct them. You know, I've said this one right, say this one, don't prolong this message, don't prolong this side. Tomorrow, when you have the opportunity to preach, don't stress on this introduction for 15 minutes because introduction should be maximum two minutes. Then you change. Now tell them. There is introduction, there is transition, there is the main body, and there is what? Conclusion. So when you are preaching, let it be at the back of your mind. Now you see, so the role of a mentor is to guide them. Are you understanding me? One time I was in Canada and Pastor Osmanpo was preaching and I, I watched Watch, and when I came back, I sat him down. I said, Sofu, what you did, you copied for me. It's a bad practice. You remember? I said, it's a bad practice. It's a bad practice. Don't do it. If you follow this pattern, one day they will criticize you. Me, I am dealing with it. <laughs> so don't start. I know you love me. You want to learn everything about me, but this particular gesture, don't do it. Do it this way. So you see, I want him to be better than me. So that he doesn't repeat my errors. Are we communicating? You are repeating errors because you don't have mentors in your business. Somebody has done business for 30 years. Sit down and learn from the person. Sometimes eh, go and wash their car. They will teach you one strategy and it will be done. Oh, the way you clap your hand, the time is over. <laughs> Can I help you again? Service, not but it's good. It's good. I was preaching, who dropped me? But now, watch me. Watch me. When you have a mentor in your life, your mentor will never speak until you ask him a question. Always ask questions. Always ask questions. Every mentor is a well of information because over the years, he has acquired certain experiences that he did not get from the books. Now watch me carefully. If you're a pastor here and you think going to the Bible school will give you a big church, it's a lie. Bible school does not give you a big church. Grace and mentorship that gives you a big church. So when you ask questions, some things will be shared with you that you cannot acquire in school to your lifetime. You can't. You will not find it. There are secrets. Now, when I enter the auditorium, there are things I will see or who super will never see until I teach him that see it this way. Even in the prophetic, there is the grace to prophesy and the experience to prophesy. Are, are we communicating here? There is the grace to prophesy and the experience to prophesy. But the grace is a gift. But after, you need the experience to prophesy. And that comes when your mentor can help you, teach you, hold your hands, and push you there. So Jesus said, anything you see me do, my father taught me. I only do what I see my father does. He said it, technically. So his father taught him. That is why when he hit the rock, he said, my father, my father, why have you abandoned me? He went for consultation. That I have hit the rock. Hi, am I going to die? And I'm sure the God whispered into his ear, don't worry. You jump over this. So he said, let your will be done. Because he had had in... Oh. <laughs> watch me. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Apostle, Apostle, watch me. <laughs> so in the beginning, the guy wanted to stop dying. But when he had communication with his father, he got the strength to go through the cross. Hear me carefully. You can only survive... When, there is time, when you get into a moment of, of turbulence, if you have somebody who will speak to you, one word, one word, one word will give you some inner tenacity to push.
Hebrews. There were so many people who wanted to stop ministry, who wanted to kill themselves. But when they had an encounter with me, I laughed. I shook my head. I said, one lie. Today, they are pushing on. They are fighting on. Ladies and gentlemen, you need somebody. You need somebody. You need somebody. Yes. You need somebody who has made it in life. Yes. Somebody who has gone to war. Somebody who has cast on him. To help you. <clears throat> Sit down, sit down. Sorry, I didn't come for this, but it's also so good. Now watch me. What is the proof of a mentor? The proof of a genuine mentor is a man who has scars. A man who has no scars cannot be a mentor. He's a boy. Men who can mentor are men who have failed, who have struggled, who have seen it all. They've gone to the battle. They've dodged bullets. They've shot their legs. They have bandages all over their, themselves. So now they will tell you, when you are going to war, when you get to this bridge, don't go through here because I went through, they shot my leg. How can I be a leader if I've not gone through it? But the saddest thing is that when the mentees are following the mentor, when they see their scars, they magnify their scars. They don't know that they went through the scars so that you'll be scarless. <laughs> So Noah's son will see the nakedness of his father. He didn't know that it's not easy to fabricate an ark. It's not easy to fabricate an ark. It is not easy to carry dirty animals in the boat or in the ark. It is not easy to even do the selection. After that, the guy is stressed. So he took in some little alcohol so that you will not drink. But the guy said, Daddy, I didn't. Hey, oh, Papa, did you know? Preco, no catch on, mammy, say, Mammy, I don't know him so sad. I said, Chey, oh, Benny, I bet to. Oh, Nia, no, no, honey, as you say, oh, mammy, honey. Ladies and gentlemen, when you have, you, have, you have the opportunity to be close to a man who has made it, and you see his nakedness and his weakness, glorify God for it. Thank God, because that nakedness will help you to be covered. The Wednesday service has changed. Don't worry, we'll pray, we'll pray. Number two, you need a contemporary. A contemporary. Somebody who is in the same level with you. And those people, they are there to criticize you. They will not appreciate you. Listen, Nobody in your age mate will appreciate you. When they say you are doing well, it's a lie. They are competitors. They are your contemporaries. They are in the same level with you. They would definitely want to have what you have. They would definitely want to speak the way you speak. They would definitely want to be in the same realm you are. And because they are not there, they will be competition. You need them. Do you know why you need them? So that it will keep you in check. It will keep you in check. Because when you fail, your mentor will not celebrate. When you fail, those under you, they don't care. But when you fail, those who criticize you are your contemporaries, your co-equals, those in the same level with you because they think your failure is their success. I do. A group of contemporaries said to themselves, we place a curse on us to see that poor will die. We place a curse on us to see that Paul will die. No, the apostles never did that because they are mentors. Jesus never did that. He's a mentor. But the co equals, they want you dead. They want you to go down. So you need them. So when you are stepping, you check. Say, the Pintobia Guana. Listen, I'm afraid of my contemporaries more than my mentors. Yeah. You know why? Because they will watch you with a fake account. They will not watch you with their account because they are not genuine. They are watching you not because you are preaching well. They are watching to punch holes in the things you are saying. So when they are preaching, they will use as shades against you. You need that. And when you throw the shade against you, sit back and correct it and grow and grow and grow and grow and grow. Now, oh, you don't like this one. You don't like this one. Now watch me carefully. Now if you know that you have so many enemies against you, you do well. 
you work harder. You push. Listen, me, I know that many people want me to fail. And that is my motivation. I want to prove them wrong. That God really called me. God called me. Yes. So by, by that, I will not sleep. I will not stop praying. Yes. I will pray. Yes. They will keep watching. I will pray. They will keep watching. I will keep succeeding. Yes. I will keep making. Can I pray for you? Yes. Don't kill your enemies, but pray for them. I pray for the ability to stand and pray for your enemies so that you succeed them all. Lift your voice and shout power. power. I shall prepare a table before you in the presence of not your mentors, so your enemies, your contemporaries. Your contemporaries. Your contemporaries. Your contemporaries. Ladies and gentlemen, hear me carefully. When you hear that people are criticizing you, Thank God. If you hear that someone is competing with you, thank God. If you hear that someone is doing what you are doing, thank God. Because that will help you become a better person. That will help you. Take your seat. That will help you. That will help you. Finally, you need those underneath. Those who are below thee. Look at me. There's something... There are things I cannot do. Not that I don't want to do. I can't. I must not do. Do you know why? Because of who's member. Because of Osobo. Because, because of him. Because of the people sitting in front here. You know why? Because when they see me do, they'll be so disappointed in me. So not that I can't do. I can do. But because of the people who look up to me, they are destined. They, they've trusted me. They've put their trust in me. They've put their destinies in me. They are waiting for me to drive them to their destination. As a result of that, there are certain things I cannot do. Number two, there are certain things I must do. Because they are looking up to me. So, Ousu Mempa and my pastor, they stretch me to do crazy things. You know why? When I fail, I fail with all of them. So, those underneath me, if you want their welfare, it will better you. Watch me carefully. If you have people who look up to you, they are not just looking up to you, you are looking up to them. You didn't get it. You are looking up to them. They are not looking up, you are looking up to them. Because watch me carefully. If tomorrow, let's say Osofu hears that I've gone to the club and I'm, I'm drunk and I'm vomiting all over the place. When my mentor hears that I've done that, I'm not ashamed. But if he hears that I've done that, I'll be ashamed of myself. Because his confidence in me will be gone. Mm. 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 Most people are hurt because they saw their mentors do the things they did not expect them to do. Are you aware? God. Most people are offended. They are hurt. Because they saw their mentors do certain things that they were not supposed to do. Most people have stopped church because they saw their pastor do some things they did not expect the pastor to do. Now, sit down, please. Let me show you something. Come. Stand here. What's your name? Gideon. Okay. Let's say you saw Gideon on the street and Gideon is holding somebody's waist. A girl, not a man, and do it. <laughs> Listen, you watch and you leave. Are you understanding? What is that? It's normal. Oh, he's a church member. But can you imagine you saw me there and I've held the waist of the lady and me. You know what you do? Quickly, you pick your phone and you do like. <laughs> Evidence. Because this man at this level. I don't expect him to do the things he's doing. Not that he can't do, he will not do it because of the people who look up to him. Now watch me. So you, you have to be there and stay there because of the people who look up to you. So your, your mentees, they are not just your mentees, so you're also looking up to them. You need them. You need them to keep you in check. To keep you in check. That is the reason why, listen, if you don't take cautious of those who follow you and you don't train them well, eventually you lose your kingdom. Because a king without subjects is not a king. I had a shot association. 
Shout association. Shout association. So whichever level you find yourself, find somebody to look up to you. Find somebody to find. Fine. If you don't have one, go and look for it. There will be no show. Wow. Wow. Now, something happened. I will not say it here. It's between me and Sofu. And something that happened. Now, something happened. And so I called Sofu. And I said, Sofu, X, Y, Z has happened. What's Papa? What can I do? And that is, you see, do you know what I learned from him? I learned from him that I should not disappoint him. You bab? Because whatever that happened, he could have just said, it's not in your jurisdiction. Why are you crossing barrier? But he said, no, I see you as a mentor. And as you have spoken, it's resolved. He said, call the person involved and tell the person whatever he wants, I will do it for him. This is what he told me. I said, really? He said, yes. Whatever he wants to do, he should just tell you. He said, Papa, I don't want to even have a conversation with the person. Let the person come and see you again. Whatever he wants, I will do it. When he left my office, I said to myself, whatever my children want, which I'll do. So, I learned from him by that gesture. Sorry, John, I swear. My point. <laughs> I'll preach my message next week. Now, walk to somebody and tell the person, you need somebody in your life. Quickly, say you need somebody in your life. You need somebody in your life. Come on. Say you need somebody in your life. Say you need somebody. Say you need somebody in your life. Come on. Do it. You need it. You need him. You need somebody in your life. You need somebody in your life. You can't stand alone. You can't fight alone. You need somebody. The Bible says, one shall chase a thousand. Two shall chase ten thousand. It's association. The Bible says, out of two months, a matter is established. So nothing is established until you have somebody. Are you understanding me? Nothing is established until you have somebody. That is the reason why you are shaking and you are wobbling all over because you don't have anybody. You are fighting alone. Who is your prayer warrior? Yakadima Kataya. Two heads are better than one. I feel this all you're here. Yes. Ha! Ah, you are Ajiman. You are last killer. You are Alpha. You are Omega. You are the beginning. You are the even God said, let us create. Even God. Even God. Even God said, let us create. There are certain things you can never achieve until there is somebody involved. You can't achieve it until there is somebody involved. The person might not bring you capital, but he'll just say a word. Makati hey. I feel this all you're here. Yes. Can I talk to somebody here? Yes. When God called Moses, he never called Joshua. But it was Joshua who won the battles for Moses. Makati Baha. The only thing Moses did was to lift his hand above. That was the only thing he was doing. And Caleb and her held his hand up. Ladies and gentlemen, you are getting tired because there is nobody to hold your hand. You are going down because there is nobody to help you out. I pray for somebody. May God raise strategic man. Right man. Right man. Right man. Right man. Right man, right man. Right man. Right man. Right man. The guy at the pool. Jesus asked him, Do you want to be healed? He said, I have no man. Yes, healing are connected to men. Divinity becomes reality when men are involved. <laughs> One thing I say, I bet chance of what I say. Divinity becomes reality when men are involved. Hear me carefully. Everything spiritual is interpreted by men. God speaks to us, but you see the prophetic in, re prophetic in reality when Emmanuel J mentions names. Wow. Wow. Nyame kasa. Nase ni pe ni wa. Obede use nyame kasa. Oh, me yasophobia, me yopia, nyame o shira no, sa nyame na be shira me. Hey. <clears throat> One time, I'd come from America. You remember my Thai business? Yeah, I did Thai business. First Thai. 
12 containers. And one of my boys who served me, I gave him the ties to sell. I was offering him in Xiao. That was my early times. I said, I gave the ties to the boy. 40 feet container. And he sold the things, whether he chopped the things or squandered the thing or gave that I, I didn't know. I'd come from America and I said, Ties is sick and no way. No, I say, but they are free. And I'm so okay. My face carries weight than your face. I'm more weight here. So go and show me where. Till today, he couldn't show me. So where's the container? Where are the goods? So, Pastor Otu, you know him. So he went to Otu and told Otu, on Janassel, Nyami Oshira Anono, Sanyami Nabe Shirami. It's over 10 years. He's still struggling. Probably would have been in charge of all my businesses. Probably. If he was, he was faithful in that little container, probably would have been the guy who would be traveling and bringing in the containers. Probably. He's waiting for God to bless him. When God has brought a man. <laughs> <laughs> you get it? He's still waiting as I'm talking. He's still waiting for God in Takrade. And the man you think he's nobody keeps going on. You need a man. You need a man. You need a man. You need a man. Pharaoh was a king, but he needed Joseph to interpret his dream. Listen, everybody needs one man who will interpret the dream that God has given to you. I am not in church. 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 Listen, for the dream you will dream of, but there are men who can give the dream you have and the interpretation of the dream. They are men. They are men. They are men. They are men. They are people. God has given them special grace to be with you. Humble yourself. And learn from them. Humble yourself. Ahantai. Everyone could see where. Ahantai. A place like Africa. If you are not careful, pride will take over you. Because of the amount of suffering that we have in this country. Lift up your hands. Maybe. Put your hands down. Let me say this thing. One day, a certain young man came to me. He knelt, I was praying for him, and God opened my eye. And I saw the thing that guy had said about me. Horrible things. Horrible. He said this, he studied, he said it. But the guy is kneeling before me. And I asked him, God says, You have said this, you have said that, you have said this. You have said that. The guy bowed down his head. He started weeping. He said, Baba, I didn't know who you were. I didn't know who you were. I went everywhere now and they said, the only person who can help me is you. I should come to you. There is a top musician in this country. Top musician. She was in concert in Italy. Was it Italy? Italy or Germany? No, it was in Italy. And she had five days to get into Italy. Everybody has disappointed her. Not that she has not traveled before. She travels regularly. She travels. Bam. But this time around, the visa was not coming. And somebody said, run to prayer palace. Where the old said, run. When you go, talk to Prophet Emmanuel J. And earlier, she had seen me at the radio and she just walked past me. Huh? She didn't know I was the one who took her to Italy. I just passed. So she came in and then she said, Papa, I have to go to a concert this Friday, and today is Monday. At that time, my protocol was called David. Yeah. I said, David, take her passport, go to German embassy, ask of X, Y, Z, and then let's see what God will do. She put in her application in the morning, by even the visa is out. Because association. Come, stand here. How long have you been trying to take your, your, your son to the UK? Six years. Six years. She's been trying to take the son to UK. How many of you remember passport direction? 
Was it last week? Last two weeks. Where? Last two weeks. What did I do here? You prayed for the for us, and you asked that. Uh huh. Whose whose child is filing for? A, whose child is filing for docu documents in the UK? In the UK. And you didn't even mention uh -huh. UK. Then I came. And you, you came prayed. for it, and what did I say? And you said it's a set. You it's see. A settle. Go on. Where's your son? He's in the UK. <laughs> <laughs> Last two weeks, association, association. I just mentioned whose son is filing. She has been trying for six years. She came here, the same spot, the same spot. She sent me a picture of the son who has arrived. Was he at the stadium where? No, the dad took him out. The dad took him out, dressed. Six years. He's a citizen now. He's not a citizen. Six years. Six years association. Now, can you imagine if this girl was coming to church and somebody met you? You are going to probably demand, Ababanos, Ababanos, Ababanos. <laughs> you know what she's doing? They are magnifying your helper in a very bad way. Mm. So by the time you realize, you go away. Mm. Association. 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 Lift up your hands. You're going to pray with all seriousness. You're going to cry on God. The Father, today, open my eye hey. to find the right person I must associate with. Hey. Open my eye. Yes, open Lord. my eye. Oh. Open my eye. Yes. Are you ready? Yes. So in the name of Jesus. Help me with a sound. I'm struggling. I don't know why it went off. When I scream, it goes down. Uh, please help me, sound. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Are you here? And I'm in Okay. 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 <laughs> Let me give you more scriptures. Naaman, very powerful army general. Powerful. By him, they've won victories. Right? He's honorable. He has people under him, but he was a leper. He was a leper for years. One day, a servant, a slave girl, a booty of war, came to the wife and said, Mama, if you can only tell Papa that if we can go to my country, this thing will be healed. Listen, there are people who have solution to your problem. A hunting tea obre. If only... Now watch me. The man now traveled and go there. When he got there, the prophet said, go and wash yourself. Another association. That guy was going to do papa. But I'm sure somebody spoke to him. I'm sure somebody. Ah, he's a seven. He said, if he had told you to do something, you have done it. Can you please do it? You see, a servant of the wife and his servant triggered the miracle. He was honorable. He had, watch me. Oh, thank you, Jesus. He had the signature of his boss. He had an introductory letter, but it didn't work. It didn't work. It was the introduction and the words of a servant. Go and wash yourself. He washed seven times. The guy is healed. What you two know? What you two know? Brian wants what? A casa bompire bobby what? You don't know what God will do through this prayers. Let the hands be up. One day, somebody came here. He was sitting down. He wants to learn from me, but he had that one cross the leg. What did I tell you? He said, You want to come and learn from me, and I'm preaching across your leg. I told you, I can't do it. What can you do? Kotal. Okotole to ombada. Yes, I got This one. This this impenetrable language. Shut in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. My father, my father. My father. My father. Open my eye. Open my eye. Say, oh Lord. Oh Lord. Open my eye. Open my eye. To find the right people. To find the right people. Say, oh Lord. Say, oh Lord. Oh Lord. As I clap my hands. As I clap my hands. Open my eye. Now. Clap your hands. 
Let's begin to pray. This is low. In the name of Jesus. Next prayer point. Oh. I shall not miss my helpers. Amen. I shall not miss my helpers. Amen. Father, whoever yes, Lord. is destined to help me. Yes. When I meet them, I shall not miss them. Rakate yes. Bahataya. Your two attire. Yeah. Can I pray for someone? Yeah. After you step out today, yeah. you shall meet your helpers. Yeah. I say, as you step out today, yeah. you shall meet your helpers. Yeah. You shall meet your helpers. Yeah. You shall meet your helpers. Yeah. Let your arms sound like Penta. Yeah. You'll be shocked that the reason you are struggling is because you miss someone. Who was destined?
Hey! Lift up your voice. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Rakadabata. Ayaya. Help us. Help us. Help us. Help us. Help us. Don't be cry, walk around, walk around and play and take charge. Find your helpers, find your helpers. Ia tata tata, Ia kotia. Radata, Ia tata, Ia tata, Ia tata. Ia bala. Lift up your voice. Alea, Padomaya. Lift up your voice. Bottle. Let me pray for this lady. Come, come, quickly. Obi, you should show. The person has been looking for it for seven years. 
The person has been looking for you for seven years. Get me the oil. Seven years, the person has been looking for you, but the person is calling you on the wrong number. The last number that is supposed to be five, the person is calling seven. Do you know your number? Yes, please. What's the last number? I have a lot of numbers. I'm talking about the one that has the last number, five. Yes. Don't eight, you know your number? I have, I have. Eight, Zero, five. two, four, six. Yes, eight, five. The person has been calling. Oh, you gave me your number? No. Uh-huh. So don't ask us if you gave me your number. The person has been calling you for more than seven years. Of oh, Fred, the last number, no. I just saw it here. 0246-344-685. For seven years, the person has been calling you. The person is looking for Oredua. Yes, I'm already here. Professor. Seven years. Seven years. The person has been looking for you. Seven years. Anytime the person calls, a, a certain person pick the call. She is not the one. 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 Your destiny helper is calling a wrong number. That is the saddest thing in life. When your destiny helper is calling a wrong number. Stretch out towards her. In 24 hours, we unlock her breakthrough. Jesus. Amen. Only seven people shout at an army. Yeah. I said, only seven people shout at an army. Yeah. Amen. Listen, if you know what we are doing today, Ankawo. Now, today, if I call you, the timelines for your breakthrough is 24 hours. Yeah. You couldn't yeah. shout, you couldn't shout, and yeah. I'm in the yeah. house. Yeah. Yes. I said your timelines to receive the breakthrough is going to be 24 hours. Amen. The one that believes I'm a prophet. By the next six hours, receive a breakthrough. Yes, sir. Receive a miracle. Yes, sir. Receive a breakthrough. Yes, Let your arms sound like thunder. Yes. By a prophet, a nation was rescued. By a prophet, the nation was sustained. Kadima Hatoya, can I be your prophet? Can I be your prophet? In the next 24 hours, yes, receive divine rescue. Receive, it. receive divine rescue. Receive it. Whatever God has placed on you, yes, it shall manifest. Yes, it shall manifest. Amen. It shall manifest. So an army like tender. Uh, can you imagine, Apostle? Can you imagine the raven? That was set, sent to feed the prophet. Can you imagine if Obia Ope Opo, Asian or Kwan or Bon to pay? No, who ya? Anka Edianena Abon. Anka for many, many, many months on the day. Some of you, that's your problem. Obi Abo or helper too. Obi Alok or helper. Go and ask Daniel. Daniel chapter 10 is there. He prayed. That same day, the miracle was released. But what happened? A, an angel held the miracle for 21 days. That is your problem. Your miracle, your helpers are in bondage. Lift up your hands. Sometimes pray that God will set your helpers free. Lift up your hand. Shall my father, my father, my father, my father, my father whoever, whoever has arrested, has arrested my helper, helper today, lose them now. Power. Because that's what sometimes, oh, I hear a soup. Yeah, what you hope? Or so forth, you hope. Then I bypass or so forth. No, my shell won't come. We do any my bypass, my say we come. But main quandary, I don't know where we are. My brother, boom. Now, oh, two, three. 
Now, are you understanding me? Yes, sir. Where were you sitting? You were sitting here. You are sitting first. But I bypassed you and I went to her. Why? Now, we will be in hell. Lift up your hands. Wherever my helper is, whoever has caught, caught my helper in captivity, I lose my helper. Amen. 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 Say in the name of Jesus. My father, my father. Say my father, my father. Whoever my helpers are. Mama, come. Come. You will not die. What did I say? You cannot die. Amen. Obi, I to powder a good yam. The good yam no mamma in Hale. Now, Obi and Odia, they are shinichi. We hope Friday. If we don't pray for Mama, she'll be walking. All of a sudden, I said, We go to dream. We can see and run on. By Sunday, she'll, pra- she'll paralyze. Who works at the audit service? Audit. Your wife. Audit service. Tell your wife. Or oh, you told me. Okay, good. Maybe he's only holding my because I can't check because I don't got to enjoy me. Watch me. Me who said Obi. At for a letter of promotion at the team. At your sack. Audit service. Audit service. But here, you cannot stand behind me. Yeah. Hold the honor yes. for your wife to be sacked from the workplace. I annul it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Can I, can I push it? Can I go deeper? Ah. Who is Sonia? Sonia rush out who is Sonia your sister's daughter where is she she's in the US she's in the US yes. your pastor's wife it's called Sonia your pastor's wife who again Sonia where come come all those who are called Sonia's and no Sonia's come forward This way, go that way. All the Sonia is quick now. Come, my dear, the lady in the black. All the Sonia's quickly. The devil is a liar. This demon that is looking for Sonia. I saw something like a bed. A bed that has blood on it, big. And the written Sonia is a peck, Sonia's neck, until her neck is twisted. I saw that this person I'm talking about has knelt by an altar. As soon as she left the altar, her neck was twisted. And I see posters on a church. Stretch your hand. This demonic activity will not stand. Amen. We curse that devil. Amen. Amen. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We lift a prayer. We lift, we lift up a prayer. prayer. For Sonia. For Sonia. Lord. Lord. Any attack. Any attack. Against Sonia. Against Sonia. Be reversed. Be reversed. Yes. Nah. 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 Lift your voice and begin to pray. Yeah. <laughs> 
As of the thing is you. Please sit down. I mentioned other service. Is it Sonia your, your wife's what? Who is Sonia? Sonia is my pastor's wife. Your pastor's wife. The thing is here. Yeah. Your pastor's wife. What does she do? Um, she's into selling of perfumes. Ah. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Are you close to your pastor's wife? Yes. Talk to her about what I said. Yes, sir. I will not continue because it's your senior pastor's wife. Yes, sir. For the sake of respect. So tell her if she can, she should come and see me. You are twisting and not come. You are twisting and come. Post this. And they said, okay. And this thing will happen in the space of five days. It will be so quick that by the time they realize it's an attack, they are too late. But God has revealed it. August. I see myself in August. Between the 14th and the 20th. 14th and the 20th of August. I'll handle that after service. Mama, lift up your hands. I cast the devil out of her life. Oh, Raki Hete Bahaya. Touch! If you say I'm moving $58,000. Yes, Lord! I receive it. To you, it's not money. But free money of $58,000, I grab it. I receive it. Yeah? Send the economy here. Nobody, $58,000, I show a pimp. I will kneel down and pray for the person. I just saw it. I saw a gift of $58,000 on someone. Now, listen, that's a prayer I'm going to pray. Father, I tap into this financial breakthrough. Are we communicating here? If you believe, it will work. If you disbelieve, too, it is fine. <laughs> Say, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, oh Lord, oh Lord, I tap into this breakthrough. Clap your hands and begin to pray. Lift your voice and pray. I will not say, but he's telling some few things that is happening that makes sense to what I'm saying. Stay or say, let me listen and come say and wait more. We've been doing this for how many years? See, ask, ask us of one. The first time I met them, I met them in Houston. I was giving them the address, the address of their house back to back. That's 2013, 2014. Back to back, their house address. I was telling them, giving them the road, the way their road looked like. Yayacho. Yayacho. Bra. Madam Bra. Where's your husband? Is at work? Oja or Bede? Ebehame. Ebehau. Yes, Oja or what? Yes, on Jao. Go for me, eh, but ate, good mate. In mate. Ate. In te. Yes. Only in te. Yes. Obi born te. Yes. Ne you kunu if you. Ne say, uncle another place. So I saw the second platform. 
So they took your husband from the first platform to the second platform. And they said he should stay there. And I see, instead of them taking you from that platform to the second platform, they left you there. And we say, you are a different person. I'm on our platform. So. No, 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 it's our platform. So. Jesus. I am not saying this to make me feel good. It's the truth. Next year, if you don't pray, you guys will go to court. Jesus. He's a very good guy. Yes. You're a good person. But listen. Jesus. Come. Jesus. Come. I feel oil here. Oh. I feel oil here. I feel oil here. Yes. I feel oil here. Yes. Say, come. Anything you are praying for or praying about, say the spirit of the living God, it is done. Hallelujah! Thank I, you, I like a spirit. Thank like you, spirit. Jesus. I repeat for the last time, God says, I should tell you, anything you are praying for Hallelujah. or praying about, Thank you, Jesus. he, the Lord, Thank has you, done Jesus. it. Thank you, Jesus. Take it. Mighty warrior, great in battle, Jehovah is your. Everybody say, Mighty warrior, mighty warrior, and we so great in battle, Jehovah is your. Something that looks like a breakthrough is coming. But it's not a breakthrough. It's your grave. Something that looks like a breakthrough is coming. But it is not a breakthrough. Somebody who is acting as a politician is about to locate you don't say, I have met a big man. They are going to use for ritual. If I go deep, I'll step on a toe. And I might go to court. I don't want to go to court. But hear me. Somebody is coming your way. Somebody is coming your way. He's acting as a politician. He's there to harm you. Your breast, your private parts are in a bowl. And in the bowl, I saw concussion and the person is drinking. They need you for rituals. But hear me. Because it has been revealed. God will protect you. But. Now to the end of election. Don't. Go out. With any politician. Makasewe. Whether. He's an assembly man. See, because I do it, I hear me say, you can't avoid it. Yeah. Assemblyman, DC, DC, MP, what again? MC, anything political or any affiliation with politics. TMEA, answer, who 2025? Suffer in dignity.
The person popped up at the time you needed help. They gave you $10,000. You lost, forgot this prophecy. You forgot it. Listen, I pray for grace. May come in every row. I'm a time of swan. I see a proud car. This was a fact. Yeah. That is when you remember what I said. And you say, let me go and see another pastor to cancel it. So that I go for it. Hear me. So for being to win you. Because this prophecy has no condition. If I want to give you a condition, the only condition is run away. Did you hear what I said? Yeah? Udia Gro. First of January. Now one tears as yes. You'll be gone. Because what I'm saying, or picture at the Okranda, you are part of 17 women who must be used. Or you are among the 17 women who must be used. But God will save you. Ah, let me go further. Whether he's a politician outside this country, a Beninois, a Togolese, a Bokenabe, an Ivorian politician. Anything politics. Whether he's a lawyer who works with government, a doctor who works with government, anybody who has any political affiliation, run. Anybody who wears political color, sponsors political color, run. Alaji, prophet, Hindu, anybody, run. Ote, can you do it? Yes, please. Sit down. I'm the one that you have shown mercy. Hey! that person out of your family now you foul spirit that wants to break the home leave this family now break let a lie uh huh uh huh now now uh huh leave the family now break now uh huh uh huh now break 
follow your manifestation and go now. Uh huh. Yes. Uh huh. Obeko. 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 I told you, say, Obeko, you go. You cannot take her marriage from her. Break! Break! Clap hands and make it up right. I hear in the spirit it is settled. Amen. See the way you love me. See the way. Who came to church are too dull. Is it because of the rain? Come on, give him some credit. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. They have planted black three three black eggs in her womb. Three black eggs. In the how many children do you have? Two. Two. Why am I seeing three black eggs in your womb? Are you planning to conceive again? No, no. Not now. Hear me. Three black eggs are in your womb, meaning three dead children must come out of you. Three dead children must come out of you. That is the meaning of three black eggs in your womb. Three black eggs in your womb. If you are not careful, you bury three children before you hit the age 60. But God says, I should not allow it. Look at me. Scream never. Never. Let me last. Scream never. Never. Scream never. Never. Father, I save your daughter. <laughs> Settled. Give God some praise. Yes, Lord. Anything you lay your hands on will prosper. Amen. Sit down. Now, quickly, lift a seed in your hand before mm. we do the last two prayers, and then you sit down, and I'll start ministering to you. Right. Quickly, you are using this seed to provoke heaven, and this provocation is releasing your helper. You are provoking heaven to release your helper. You are provoking heaven. To release your helper. Listen, if you have one Ghana sitting in your hand, your helper is equivalent to your money. 
Some of you are not serious. So you are praying for helpers and you are picking anything. Labadasha. Did you hear a testimony from the one in Kuwait? She said she was there all of a sudden, she went paralyzed. Then one side, you remember? One side of her body went dead. So she could only type. So she took the phone and gave it to the fiance. Type prophet demanded a J. And the guy died. Luckily, I was by the phone. I picked the phone. I said, carry the woman out. Let her walk. She went out and all of a sudden, the parallelism disappeared. She started walking normal. Yeah. Quit. The person is in Kuwait. Not a shaman. Quit. Quit. She said, I've been looking for it for four years to testify. Four years. I've been looking. I've been calling your life for four years. I'm not getting to you. Yeah. Lift the seed up. Provoke heaven with a seed. And tell God, God, let the heavens release my helper. Then we'll do two last prayers. And I begin to minister to you. Today by 2 o'clock, I'm done. Because we are coming back on Friday for the all night. Are you ready for the perfume direction? Good. Say, in the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. As I touch the altar. As, as I, I touch, touch the, altar, the altar. With my seed. With, with my, my seed. I provoke the heaven. I provoke, I provoke the, the heaven. Over my life. Over my life. To release my miracle. To release my miracle. In Jesus' name. Jesus. Jesus. Quickly, let's go. From the back.
I minister to you for the next 15 20 minutes and then we are done. Amen. Don't forget, Friday is all night. Now I'm reserving all the energy for Friday. Six hours of prayer and the prophetic. Now listen, you are praying this prayer. Anybody who is an enemy but will pretend as a helper, Father, expose them now. Amen. Now there are people who are pretending as lovers, but they are enemies. There are people who, who pretend as if they are there to help you, but they are rather there to destroy you and to harm you. You are praying the Father exposed there. Shut in the name of Jesus. In the name, in the name of, of Jesus. Jesus. It's like today, you do like, is it because of small rain? Or is it because you came and then because of rain, people did not come, so you are thinking, really? Really? Hello? Hello? Shut in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. My father, my father. My father, my father. Any pretender. Any pretender. In my life. In my life. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Expose them. Expose them. Yes, Lord. Expose them. Expose them. Expose them. Some of the people pretend as lovers. They are in your come to feed on information. Jesus. Or they are there to collect information and give to your enemies. Really? May God expose them. Amen. 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 Shut in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. And the pretender. And the pretender. In my camp. In my camp. What, are for? what are you waiting for? Be exposed. Be exposed. Nah. In your husband's life or your wife's life Jesus. or in the lives of your children, Amen. may God expose them now. Amen. I need so, men, but not wrong men. I need men, but not wrong men. Shut in the name of Jesus. Where are the warriors? Shut in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. My father, my fighter. My father, my fighter. And the pretender. And the pretender. In my family. In my family. In my life. In my life. As a clap my hands. As I clap my hands. In my family. In my family. In my life. In my life. As I clap my hands. And stomp my feet. Be exposed. Be exposed. Be exposed. Clap your hands and fire. Fire. Let your voice sound like thunder. Prayer. 
Jesus. Any evil pits Roar. set for me and my family. Roar. Prophetically, I declare, yes, Lord. I escape now. Amen. Shut escape. 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 You are too quiet. You are too quiet. Shut escape. Escape. Shut escape. Escape. Shut escape. Shut escape. Power. Any evil trap Roar. set for you and your business. Roar. Today, I declare. Yes, you will escape. Amen. You shall escape. Amen. You shall escape. Amen. Stop escape. Yes, we escape. Power. Yes, Lord. Are you ready? He that digs a pit for his neighbor shall fall into the same pit. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. I don't need helpers who will dig pits for me. For me to fall into it. Yes, Lord. Yeah. Some helps are traps. Are you aware? Some helps are traps. Oh, yes. Yeah. They'll say, oh, I'll take you to America. Who do work with? I shall. Haven't seen that before? I know people who have been paying in Germany for 12 years because somebody took them to Europe. How much is a visa to Europe? They've been working for 12 years to settle a bill of visa. Yeah. And always they threaten them. There are people watching me online who are outside this country because they don't have right documents. So they are using people's documents. And say, can bar, they choose to give them how much they'll give them. Bamboo the work. Hey, monkey the work, bamboo the chop. So you make $3,000, 2,000 euros, 2,000 pounds, and the person say, you are owing. A little girl, wow, sorry, my dear, sorry, I will not mention your name, but you told me. It's sad. She's just, is it 19 or 21 years? The person who said, I will help you, is now telling her she owes $5,000 tax. How much is her salary, 19-year-old girl? Because she's working with your document. Some helpers are traps. When you fall into it, you can never be free. Some people came into your life, they said they love you. You open your heart to them. Apparently, they are demons. You've, you've, you, you, have, you, 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 have, you have sold your soul to the devil. I need men, but not traps. My God. Not traps. You are praying. Any demonic trap. Yes, Lord. Set for me and my children. Yes, Lord. As I clap my hands in prayer, yes. I declare an escape. 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 Yes. So escape. Escape. Power. I remember those days. I was in France. And I needed to change my ticket quickly to America. And a guy I met in the church, the pastor said, oh, this guy can help you. This guy can help you. And the guy said, because of what you did for my pastor and the powerful things you've been doing in our church, I want to get you the ticket for free. I was excited. I went to the hotel, I slept, and God opened my eye, and God said, he's using somebody's credit card to buy it for you. So don't take it. Hey, hey, trap. Who see you and your soul says, Come, follow me, follow me, follow me. Hey, follow me. How did you get your ticket? What do you for? Need the member social media. How am I going to explain? I go explain tire. I go explain, sir. I go tire. So it was a blessing, but a trap. You are praying. Escape from every trap. Amen. One power, two power, three. Clap your hands and pray. Are you ready? Yes. One, power. two, power. three. Power. Clap your hands and fire. Yes. Shabby, I'm not a 
Jesus, yes, I declare an ask I declare an ask I declare an ask Shall I shall escape. I shall escape. Power. Yeah. Yes. Tracy. Tracy. Tracy Tracy Carlin, sex at gmail.com. Run to me. Tracy Carlin, sex at gmail.com. Priscilla Ousu. Your own is emergency. Priscilla Ousu. I'll get the person. An emergency car a bono six pm today. Praise Allah. All right, come. Can I pray for you? Hey, can I pray for you, boss? Is that your first time? I uh, enter. Sorry, sorry, sorry. But you know. You are Priscilla Usu. Cousin. You too. Hey, and the what jam will come jam or cousin. Come, come. Jana, Jana. Oh, your bar. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Never care. And bar cry out thief. All right. Listen. You have missed a breakthrough in 1992. A white man was supposed to adopt him in Switzerland. A white man was supposed to adopt him in Switzerland to will all his estate to him. He missed it. Which year are we now? 2024. So how many years now? Mathematicians. 32 years. The man is now 80. Where were you in 1992? Um, I should be in UK by then. UK then? Yeah. Have you been to Switzerland before? Yes, please. Which year? It's 1992. I can't, I can't it doesn't even remember. What way? A man, is a, he's a white man, but a Christian, met you and somebody around a train station. No, you, I'm talking to him. <laughs> I see him in you. So he says, mm. You are connected? No. You don't know. You are not connected. Because the white man I'm talking about is called Rubin. And this guy must also have the name Rubin. Who is Rubin? My name is Rubin. 
processor. The white man. The white man is supposed to will all his properties to you. I said in 1992, my name is Prophet Emmanuel J. Yes, Lord. You went to Switzerland. Ah, I don't miss prophecies. Also, call me this number quickly. Zero two four six one one seven seven three zero. Go and ask that Prissy Carlin. Huh? Friend Mammy Namen Kasa Men Kamen Kama Jun Chen. So I pray Osofuka has a number. Me, my name is Prophet Ivana J. I don't I don't miss prophecies. Yes, Lord. I don't miss. You may check. Madam, come. Step here. Step. Step. Is that our first time here? Sister. Who brought you? Huh? My sister. Your sister. Don't, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Relax, okay? I am very I am very scary, but nice. You will not go through surgery. Okay? I said you will not go through surgery. Amen. Any surgery they have prepared for you, it will not happen. Amen. Because I have canceled it. Jesus. I repeat, I have canceled it. When was the last time you went to the hospital? Last year, July. July. If they tell you you must go through surgery, tell the person it will not happen. Because if they <laughs> what did she? Yeah, the second come. We will hear no. Stand behind there. Touch. Give God some praise. <laughs> I say yes, boss. <laughs> I pray you have a fresh amper. Bossu. Yes, daddy. I say yes, daddy. <laughs> I will put the fear of God in you. Listen, you are supposed to inherit a man, a white Christian who loves Africa. You were supposed to bear his name, but the guns. Do you know someone who's a girl? Yes. Boss, talk to me. Yes, daddy. Go and sit down, go and sit down, go and sit down, go and sit down. Go and sit down. Yeah, I'll tell you. Do you want me to prophesy to you? Yes, ma'am. The way I do this. <laughs> you are shocked or you are shy? Both. Both. You are shocked and shy. <laughs> I will call you shocker. Mm. Shocker baby. Stretch on towards him. Now, what I see in the realm of the spirit is that the man is supposed to will all his properties to him. The man currently is around 80 years. Still looking for him to bless him. He doesn't know where to find him. Don't worry. I'll give you his number for that. So you call him. Yes, Lord. Professor! Where is Pearl? Did Pearl come to church? Pearl, Pearl, Pearl Poku? No, no, you. It's not prophecy, I'm talking about Pearl Poku. Pearl. Did she come to church? Oh, she's there. I'm here. Oh, come, come. Pearl, when you lost your passport, what did I do for you? Where are you here? You watch. You saw online. Yeah. She lost her passport. Oh, you were there? Yes. She lost her passport. She, I was not there when she lost her passport. Step here. What do you do? You sew. If somebody give you 200,000 Ghana, what would you use for? 
And we used to sell soap. Soap. Yes. You want to use two hundred thousand to sell soap? <laughs> what kind of soap are you selling? Are you selling heavily soap? No, but soap is selling ten thousand no, 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 no. We used to do uh, this. She, thing. She's confused. <laughs> I have asked week, you. Week, week, week. You do wake. No, my, my, my daughter. I used to help my daughter. Come, come, come. Your mother is confused. I used to help. What, what, uh, what do you want to I'll do? I will use it as my investment for my wig business. Wig business. 200,000 wig. What well. are you doing wholesale? <laughs> I said 200,000 dollars. So. And also invest in other businesses as well. Invest in what? Modeling. Modeling. Yes. You want to model? With, 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 with my 200,000. <laughs> <laughs> what will you do? I will used to do farms. You do farm? Yes. So you see, you're confused. <laughs> you don't have a plan. You see, you don't have a plan. You're confused, though, because the way I called you. Yes. Sana, we should have a bow. <laughs> All right, Pearl. I remember Pearl had come to my office and Pearl started with us, even before we started the church, right? Yes. Stand, stand, stand. Pearl, men fair. Oh, fair, they did too much. Even before we started this church, trade fair. She has been following since trade fair. You know, there are some people, they are very dear to me. Because, Charlie, when you were struggling, they were there. Yeah. So, she came to my office, true? True. People think I did connection with you. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> so, she came to me in the office... Before it was Professor uh, BTP period. No, it was few days to BTP. the first night. Few days to the first night. Yes. Was it the first night? But it was BTP period. Oh yes. BTP uh, the yeah. first. So she came to me and said, "Daddy, please, I've lost my passport." And I said, "Me I saw that her face had changed. I said, "No." They said, "Deal we must do," and the passport I cannot find. I, what did I tell you? You, you told me you would pray about it. Uh -huh. And then get back to me. And get back to you. Yes. And she left. I was prophesying and God opened my eyes. showed me where the passport is. The number of the passport. What she was wearing in the, in the, in the, in the passport. And what again? All the details. Apparently, this bank people have a system to verify document. What's the name? Vin Vin Sat or something. J5. J5. I don't know what is that. So whilst I was mentioning, I was telling her where the passport fell at the filling station. And she remember she went through that filling station. How it dropped. She was looking at me some way. And I said, that's a number. Go to passport office and tell them your passport is missing. That's a passport number. And go and get a new one. But you can get a duplicate. They were checking in church. When you have an elite member, sign on with you. Ocean come here, back and say, true. And somebody pulled it out and said, that is it. The, the same description. True? Very true. And you, you went to do your part. Do you have it now? I have it now. You have it now. Clap your hand for Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. Sit down. So sometimes, when we are prophesying, people think we are joking. The guy, I said, <laughs> the wife, who pretend as if the, the, the daughter is his. I said, that guy, that girl is not your child. Don't go and do DNA. Because you waste money. They took me to court. Yeah, they took me to court. One thing. They just said, if they do DNA and it's the guy's child, they will deal with me. I said, I'll deal with you. Go and do the check. We don't joke here. Now, some people think we are joking. So I stopped replying the guy's message. I said, tell you, finish the DNA, don't contact me. They went to do the DNA. The DNA came out. The child is not a boy's child. Now, Obia Edin, court Edin, judge Edin, Obia Edin, are you Hear me carefully. There are people who pretend to be prophets. Yes, Lord. But there are people who are born to prophesy. Hey! Was it not in UK? Listen, I'm saying all this thing for you to know that we are not joking. Was it not in UK? UK, oh, UK. I was prophesying and I called a young guy. He's watching me. He's called Frank. Frank Ado. He's not popular now. 
He's more popular than me. He was in church. The wife had left him. And I said to him, my name is Prophet. I'm putting my ministry on the line. If what I'm saying, I'm, I'm lying, I'll stop prophesying. Your wife will appear. So I said, go around. And look for somebody who looks like your wife as point of contact because your wife must call you. Whilst he was going to look for the person, the wife called. Life in church. The guy was shaking like fish. For three or, three, I think three or six months, I forgot him. The girl had left the house. I don't want to see you again. I don't want to have anything to do. He said, Papa, can I pick the car? I said, pick him. The girl picks. I'm at home waiting for you. Yeah. So the second day or the last day of the program, I have to reofficiate their wedding. And I told them, you may kiss their bride. Kiss them. And land them. Now they are my favorite children. The, the guy can't understand that the wife can come once I'm prophesying. Right. Be on your feet. Stretch out. Say, Lord, Lord. Speak to me. Speak to me. Now sit down. Boss. Boss. Yes, daddy. Okay. Your surname was supposed to be the surname of the man I'm talking about now. Your surname. Your surname. Your surname. But still, the people in the Labi family. You know Labi? Yes, please. Who is Labi? That's my surname. The Labi family. They say you will never bear the name of this man. You will never. But I'm mother. How are you? I know you. I know you. I know I met you in the UK, right? Yeah. And you have come. Are you ready to join the, the volunteers? volunteers? Are you ready to join the volunteers in the UK? Yes. Be one on the casa. I try. Uh -huh. I also pray for you that God will bless you. Amen. Plenty. He'll bless you, sir. You'll get tired. Amen. God bless you. Sit down. Labi, people don't want you to see that prosperity. But listen, he will find you. Amen. When the person gives you the, that, that estate, how much will you give me? I'll divide it into three and give one to God. You divide into three and give one to God. Go to God and go and take your estate. <laughs> I'm saying me, I'm saying God. Lift up your hands. There is something that God wants to do for you in three days. What do you want God to do for you in three days? I want to travel. You want to travel? Yes, please. Pastor, Pastor Ultrempa, have you called the lady? She's online. She's coming. Like, why Maybe you're popular. Don't make me a bit trendy. Into swan. Why? And be on your car. Why? And yet, don't indict yourself. You don't know whether the embassy is watching you. Don't indict yourself. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. What do you want God to do for you? Yes, I want to travel. Thank you. Go and sit down there. <laughs> Three days from now, God is going to surprise you. You understand? Three days from now, God is going to surprise you. True or two? And then about Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. All about all night and all the miracle, all the testimony. Amen. Amen. Be on your feet. Take it. 
give God some praise right here. No doubt for me. No doubt. Give me oil. Father, in the name of Jesus, touch! Hey, who had problem? I then had the iron. It's what come as a person. What did you do? Oh, no, Fante. Oh, no, Oga. I will go. No money. No money, no money, no money, no money, no money. I will go. I will go. No money, Feneca. No, there's somebody, somebody is giving you heart problem, heart condition. Do you dream? You don't dream. You have it, you don't do so. Do you drink? Do you smoke? Do you humanize? Do you go to church? That one, yes. <laughs> no, down. No, I'm joking, all right? I'm joking. Don't take me serious. Take the heart problem serious. Take the inheritance serious. The rest, don't take it serious. I want you to relax because you look so timid. Okay? Relax. Relax, okay? In the estates, you meet another man who will help you start a business called Steel. Steel business. Okay? And it will change your fortune in life. Take it. Come on, give God praise. someone called Keth. 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 K-E-I-T-H. Keth. Soon, soon. So your mommy. Angel born to me. You know someone like that? Uh, this Keth I'm looking for is a gaming commission. Oh, your mommy. I've entered game, gaming commission. I am at their finance department. Kurt has held his heart, and Kurt is passing out. Look for you for me, Kurt. Give me that song. Oh, yeah, Then you know. Oh, oh. Oh, yes. we, we have somebody who works at gaming commission, right? Call the person for me. Call the person, tell the person if there's somebody who works there, call Ket. Ket, mute you, mute you, wow, something, mute you, something. Quickly, don't call. If the person, they should, they should, they should give the phone to the person, one bush, bash, bush. I know somebody, and I think one of our daughters works there, so it's easy to grab the person. Come. Quickly come, please. Oh, yo. Yesterday I gave you a song to sing for me. Sing that song, old song. I want you to sing. Young God. Puma. Puma. I was driving. And as I hear it, Puma. Da da, me the Yesu baye me puma. My new lunch. Da da da. Okay, let's go. Puma. Everybody 
Tonight, that's the song we are singing on Prophesy. Puma. Puma. Ocean of Puma. Pebby. Never be online. Never saw Puma. You remember the song that came? Oh, Lada, 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 Oh, Lada, Oh, Lada, Oh, Lada, Oh, Lada. Sir, come. Shake my hand. Just come shake. No. No, just shake my hands for me. Shake. Shake my hand. Lift your hand, stand behind it for me quickly. You say you're too nini, actually, you go for Yeah, I just saw that. Yeah, uh-huh. I, I, I just saw it. Say you're too too nini, I'm an enemy for Yeah, yeah. God says you are going to see things differently from today. Lift it up, lift it up, lift it up, lift it up, lift it up. Listen, from today, your eyes will open. Tell it! Ah, something is happening. Something is happening. Something is. Now, touch your eye for me, everybody. Touch your eye. Ah, 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 ah. Check, check, check. Follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me, follow me, please. Touch your eye for me. Ah, there are seven people. God says. He's giving them, them the prophetic anointing. Listen, that is it. Uh-huh. That is it. They are serving people. God says, I'm going to open their eye into a new dimension. Now, don't hold back. Father, 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 Father. No, 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 it! Father, locate them. Serving people. Ushers. Whoever God will touch, bring the person to me. Now, that is it. That is, uh-huh, that is it. You cannot be on your feet. It's not possible. If the Holy Ghost locates you, you cannot be on your feet. Yes, uh-huh, now, touch your eye. Touch your eye, touch your eye. Now, usher here, take it. Ah, uh, uh-huh, that is it. Just focus, 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 focus. Take it! Seven people. Seven people. The last person, Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Usher. Aha, that is it. That is it. Ha 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 ha. In Jesus' name, Amen. All those God touch, bring them to me quickly, 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 bring them to me. Bring them to me. If God touch, you come. Ushers. You see, the old Pentecostal songs are very powerful. May the Jesus bear me puma. He's my everything. I can't survive without him. Puma. Come on, sing it. Puma. Open their eyes. Mama, look at me. Uh huh. Let her lie. Let her lie. Uh huh. Father, let your spirit feel fill all these people in Jesus. Hey, look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Ah. Ah. That is it. Dang it! I see. Uh huh. That is it. I see a trumpet on her mouth. She has sounded the trumpet and I hear, I hear, I hear God says watch. I watch and I saw all your flow from the trumpet and I see revivals. I, have you called? Do you know somebody there? The guy is there. 
He's there. He works there. Good. <laughs> tell him. Tell him, tell him. I, tell him I said he should come on Friday. Tell him. I don't have time now. I've gone to another room. Friday, you should come and see me. Hello, sir. Yes, he said you should, daddy said ah. you should come on Friday. Hold on. Tell, ask him okay. if you know somebody in Sunyane. Do you, know, do you know somebody in Sunyane? Somebody in Tafu. Sunyane. In, in Tafu. Yes, yes. The person is a nurse. The person is a nurse. Yes. She's called Sonia. She's called Sonia. Yes. Tell him to come. Mm -hmm. On Friday. Come see him on Friday. Puma. 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 Come and see him on da -da. Friday. Don't worry, don't worry. Please, did you get my message? He said, come and see him on Friday. Yes, please. Come and see him on Friday. I cover him. I cover him. I cover him. No harm shall befall him. Say amen. amen. Who is Sonia? Who is Sonia? Say who is Sonia? To her, to him. To you. Hello, Keith. Hello. Take his job. I don't dare dear. I'm going to be for short trial. Come. How old are you? Twenty-two. Do you know a Nigerian? You don't know a Nigerian. Then said that it's not you. It's not her. You are still tired here. You are not even sure the air can. Ah, fresh hold on. One second. Obi and Fro. Fresh your bag. Daddy, please, he's back. He's back. Yes. What's the connection between him and Sonia? Daddy said, "What is the connection between you and Sonia?" So she's my cousin. Cousin. Yes, please. Cousin. Okay, good. Tell him, I need him, and I need Sonia here on Friday. All right. Daddy said he needs you and Sonia here on Friday. There's an attack okay, okay. from Tafu. There's an attack from Tafu. Against you. Against you. And then Sonia. And Sonia. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Their daughter. Come, come. Don't forget this name, Adam. Adams. Adams has a connection in Nigeria. It's you, okay? Adams will be your friend very soon. Keep that relationship. It is not any bad relationship, it's a very good relationship. Adams has a connection. With a family who are into oil. It will get to a time in your life that you need a job and the Adams will connect you to the oil company. And one and all. Sit down. Where are they? Pick, pick, pick. Ah. Fresh oil. <laughs> Fresh oil. Pick it up for me. Pick it up for me. Change the song. Eh, you better prophesy. Look at me. Come. Lift your hands up. Look at me. That is it. Thank you, Jesus. Wave your hands at me. Out of my belly shall flow very softly. Rivers, rivers. Give me the perfume. Give me the perfume. Come on, sing it. This is the first perfume to close your past. Past errors, past mistakes, past disappointments, 
a favor. As I spray your back, you are declaring that never again. Bible said, behold, I do a new thing. That's the future. Forget about the past. So my back should be covered. Forget about the past. Lift up your hands. I took a very simple perfume, normal perfume. Let's pray your back. And let's see what God will do. Say, Lord. Lord. I end it. I end it. Sure. Six o'clock. Ask and Eba. What time will you get to the house? After here, I'll go back. Don't, what, as soon as you enter your house, don't come out. Okay. What did I say? I shouldn't come out. Don't, what did I say? I shouldn't come if out. If you step out at six, end up in the hospital. When you enter your house, don't come out till tomorrow morning. Yes, please. Right. And you are the prisoner of Wusu, right? Don't come out. Okay. Oh, bitch, I will go die home. Don't come out, said the spirit of the living God. Don't come out. Do you know anybody in a military bay? With the military. You work with the military. Yes, yes. Don't come out. Because I saw her posters at the military bay. I saw her posters at the military bay. Don't come out. Get into your room. Stay there. Pray till morning. Yes, please. It is not necessary. Whoever calls you, emergency, don't come out. Yes, please. Settled. Sit down. Have I prayed for you? Have I laid my hands on you? Sit down. I'm done. Believe him. God is she's, he's having an encounter with God. <laughs> Let her lie. Now what we'll do is that we'll do a very fast one. you come and then Pastor Husband, but you do that for me. Spray the back of their neck or the, sh- the back of your shirt. Don't worry, just a little. Esa Please, this direction is a very serious one. Do it with revelation. Are you understanding me? Now, right after you go sit down, then when we close, we'll do the, the chest one and then you go home with it. Then declaration is done. Are, are we communicating here? In Jesus' name, amen. Quickly. Your point bear. It will waste time. Yeah, it will waste time. It will waste time. So wait. After service, you do it and you go home. You do it and you go home. Kabish. Aha. Uh-huh. So let me check. Because you're also. Pip, 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 30 minutes. Your point. Why? So we'll do the two together. Give me the second one. Be on your feet quickly. Let's do the second one. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father. Father. As I go through this prophetic ritual. Through this prophetic ritual, I pray. I pray. The Father, the Father, I shall never, I shall never struggle, struggle in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. The future is bright. The future is bright. My past struggles are over. My past struggles are over. Amen. Amen. Quickly, please take your seats. We're going to have our last offerings right now, and then right after, we will do the direction. Right. Listen to me carefully. You are led to sow a seed. You can do 200. You can do 300. You can do 400. Up what? You are led to sow that seed. I'm going to give you the opportunity to do that. I want to pray for about 20 to 50 people. Pick up the seed. It's not a pledge. It's 200, 300, 400, 500. You've seen God work. And it's your responsibility to also support. And sow into the grace available. When you find a man who will help you both spiritual or physical, both spiritual and physical, you have to sow into his ministry. Not in my life, but into his ministry. When they saw that Jesus is the Savior, they came to him with mere frankincense and gold. Anytime you see God at work, move with your corresponding seed. So, the ground is now prepared to receive a seed from you. Pick up that seed quickly, come to the altar. 
200 up to whatever thousand you can do. I want to pray for you. If you can do it, please step forward. I want to pray for you. I pray that almost everybody will step out and sow the seed. Step forward. Step forward quickly. I want to pray for you. Step forward. Give me the song, please. Very soft song. Let's go. Let it flow, let it flow. Let it flow. Let it flow, let it flow. Come on, sing it. Let it flow, let it flow. Let it flow, let it flow. Flow, let it flow. Let it flow. Right. Come on, let's sing it. Listen, there are about two. There are about 20 of you who must step forward and do this. 200 is money. 300 is money. 1 million is money. But it's not equivalent to what God would do for you when you sow into the grace available. Step forward. I want to see a lot of you guys stepping forward and doing this. Now, the Bible says you shall sow in tears but reap in joy. How are you, sir? You shall sow in tears but reap Enjoy. Precious one, the altar is potent and the altar is powerful. People sacrifice animals, sacrifice bulls just to have power. At the end of the day, it becomes a snare on their neck. This altar is potent. When you sow on this altar, you have sacrifice on the altar and God will give you uncommon power. Quickly, 10 more people join for me. Let's do this quickly. Join in. Rush out. Rush out. Rush out. Father, in the name of Jesus, I declare as the altar receives our sacrifice, bless us in return. In Jesus' name, I call it done. Amen. Drop it on the altar for me. If you can, use the wings for me because of the LEDs. So if you can use the wing, God bless you. God bless you. Let it flow. Let it flow. Let it flow. Come on. Let it flow. Let it flow. Flow. Let it flow. Right here, right now. Come on, let's sing it. Let it flow. 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 You can do a seed of a hundred. You can do a seed of a hundred. Or 50. We are not doing any other offering again. That's the only offering we are doing right now. We're not even going to do any other offering. You can do a 50. You can do a 100. Please step out. Step out. And then let us do it together. Quickly. Let me pray with you as you step out. Quickly. 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 Everybody. If you are here and you are not going to participate. That means you don't trust in the grace that is working in this house. Oh man of God. I don't have it. Listen, everybody has a seed. Moses, what do you have? Nothing. But you have a rod. The only thing I have is a rod. The woman who was struggling. What do you have in your house? Nothing. But a little flour and oil. Yes, you have something. Everybody has something. God will never create a man empty. Everybody has something. Everybody has something. So, if God is asking for it, that means you have it and you must give. Please step out for me. Let's do this together. Father, in the name of Jesus, let the seed in the hands of your children attract prosperity, increase, and abundance. In Jesus' name, amen. Please drop it on the altar for me. God bless you so much. Use the wings if you can, please. Oh. Oh. Let it flow, let it flow. Let it flow. Let it flow, let it flow. Flow, let it flow. Right here, right now. For the last time, let it flow. Let it flow, let it flow. Ah, let it flow, let it flow. Let it flow, let it flow. Flow, let it flow. Right here, right now. Whatever you have in your hand, lift it up and come to me quickly. Lift it up and come to me. Come. Whatever you want to sow today. I don't have whatever I have. I have 10, I have 20, I have 30, I have 40, I have 5. Pick it up quickly. Let me also pray with you. Everybody should do something before you leave for the house. Step forward quickly. 
Step forward. And let the it river flow. flow. Ah. It begins to bring every death thing to life. Ah. It's a life giving river. Flow, let it flow right here, right now. Ah. And that's the river flow. Oh. It begins to bring every death thing to life. It's a life giving river. Flow, let it flow right here, right now. Please stretch your hands on the altar. Father, in the name of Jesus, I speak and I declare let the altar receive our sacrifice and release our miracles unto us in Jesus' name. Amen. Please drop it on the altar for me. God bless you. Quickly, let's do that. Let's do the direction. Let it flow, let it flow. Flow, let it flow right here, right now. Quickly, let's do the direction. Now, we're going to do the direction. Now, listen to me carefully. If you don't believe in this direction, don't do it. Are you understanding me? Now, I'm a prophet of God, and God speaks to me in directions. Right. God said to me last week while I was ministering that, come with two perfumes, one at the back, one in front, to end the past mistakes, the past errors, the past challenges, and spray their future. Let them smell good in the spirit. I was supposed to speak about that, how God remembered uh, Mephibosheth. Are you understanding me? How God remembered Mephibosheth, how he was, he lost everything and God remembered him. And then the smell that God gave him. When God sprays your future, you sit with kings and sit with great people. Now after this direction, may God connect you to people who matter. Yeah. Strategic people, they are people who matter in life. When God brings you in contact with them, things will become easy. Now, I said it in my submission that the biggest resources that you need is not money. It's human resource. There are places that money can't take you there. But contacts. Human contacts. I have been to places my money couldn't have taken me there. But because I knew somebody who knew somebody who knew somebody. And by that, the door opened for me. That's what we are doing. God is going to spray your future. The future will be, will, be, will be so sweet to the point that doors will begin to open for you. And things will get easier, easier. Free passage, free... Oh, your arm in the sake of Ebola. <laughs> Give me the perfume again. I want two pastors here for me. Father, it is settled. In Jesus' name, amen. I thought we'll stand here. There. I thought we'll stand here for me. Okay. Mubra, then you change. When you are tired, you give to the next pastor, right? We are closing. As soon as I spray about, go home. It's not true. I'm tired. I'm tired, though. I'm tired. I want to conserve energy for all night. Right. All those I gave you direction, don't see me. See me on Friday. Right. All those I gave you direction, see me on Friday. Right. I know, I know. There are a lot of people, more than 50 people. If you need special prayers, wait behind. The pastors will pray with you. Right. But I want to, I, I'm tired. You agree with me? They made me go and play table tennis. Now I'm struggling. I'm suffering. You see, I'm very calm. It's a table tennis. And the soccer, I'm tired. You guys did not treat me well. I'm, that I'm feeling the pain. All my joints are, are aching. So give me just today to rest because I'm, I'm struggling. I needed to be here. That's why I'm here. I, I didn't have come. So help me. Okay. Agreed. Thank you so much. I love you. I love you more. Be on your feet. Let me pray with you. I love you so much. Thank you so much for understanding. Father, I pray for your children. I cover them. I protect them. I show them. Father, as they go home, let your grace be with them. We are coming back next week with a testimony. In Jesus' name, amen. By Friday, I will give you the direction for next week, Wednesday. Please and please again, don't exempt yourself from the all night. You will never regret coming to the all night. 
anyone who had ever been to my all night will say, it's an all night with a difference. You'll be sitting here to five o'clock and you'll not get tired because it's a combo. Okay? It's a beautiful time in God's prayer. So please and please again, Friday is nine o'clock. We are all coming. Now tonight, 11 p.m., we are here online prophesying. So stay at home, tune in on any of our online platforms and I will pray with you and we'll pray together and I'll prophesy to you. God bless you. Have a beautiful afternoon. Amen. So please, not from the front, from the back. From the back. If you rush it, I'll collect my perfume and, and take it away. Don't rush it. We'll do it. When you come, you, you, he, he sprays your back. Just a little. Just a little. Then you go to Pastor Osweemba. He sprays you. Can you open these doors? Open these doors. Open all the doors there. You can exit from any door and then you go home because of time. Right. So open all the doors so we can, we can go home. All right. God bless you. Ajua, ajua. Ajua for life. All right. God bless you. Quickly, do that. Please take your seats. Take your seats. Take your seats. If you are done with the spring, you can go home. When you get to the house, pray for five minutes and declare that every prophetic word declared should come to pass and miracles should happen. So after spring, you can go home, rest, and come back on Friday at the all night.
turning and couldn't see the light. And whenever I looked up, I couldn't see the sky. Sometimes when I'm standing, seems I gotta walk for miles. Yeah, my heart could be crying in the middle of a smile. Yeah, and I climbed the hills and saw the mountains. I hung on the sound stars and I felt the strong wind. Judah. 
same girl who was there for you in the midnight hours. It's the same girl who was able to wipe the tears away. It's the same girl who was there in time of luck and want. It's the same girl who said, oh, Thank you. 